No, it wasn't me. Not guilty. Beg your pardon. You, you're the one. I assure you, we've never met. Is this a prize fighting me? You bet your eyes and ears it is, my lord, my lady. The name's Robert Topping. Best bookie in all of London, at your disposal. Well, second best, but my mum says Dom's a bit of a nincompoop. Anyhow, I can show you a vast array of exciting things, from prize fights to carriage races. I think we can afford to spend a little time here. Oh. She's killing you like a rabbit. You've got to overpower. 
What a spectacular fight, my lady. My friends, cheer as loud as you might for our new champion. The cane gives you an undeniable air of joie de vivre. Try. I brought some books. I hope I'm not intruding my being here. Quite the contrary. It's nice to have the company. A herbarium? Are you collecting flowers for someone? Only myself. I'm told it's something of a British pastime. Did you know, they all have symbolic meanings. I had heard something of the sort. Of course you have. Unfortunately, I have no time to fill the book. I could collect some samples. If you would accept my help. I would appreciate that. Thank you, Miss Fry.
Ah, Jacob, uh, Miss uh, Fry, how good to see you. Oh, have you seen Stalick's latest lies? Lies in a newspaper? What transpired from the new line you're establishing? Oh, the cables we ordered never arrived. And then we intercepted this. A message mentioning cargo seized at College Wharf. Then let's unseize it. Oh, uh, wait. Another intercepted wire contained the recipe for a powerful hallucinogenic serum. I've adapted this dart mechanism to work with your bracers. Alec, you're a genius. Well, that patently is untrue. Although, I've also discovered that the serum adopts a form of a gas when subjected to heat. Just when I think you can't surpass yourself. Sure, you're working for the right people, you lummox. Don't worry. We'll see your cables get delivered. They've got themselves a new destination.
I'm sure Mr. Bell will find this most interesting.
now. There, Mr. Bell. Every worthwhile endeavor is fraught with dangers, my dear friends. None more so than yours. But you have triumphed once again. How do you know? We have entered the age of communication, remember? We've already received word from Greenwich that the shipment has arrived safely, thanks to you. Have you discovered what else is in that shipment? Indeed. Um, I'm afraid that Starrick's poison has found its way onto the open market. If he believes that will stop us, he is mistaken. 